Hello everyone. I just want to say thank you for taking the time to stop by my channel. Thank you for taking the time to pray for me. Um, I hope you're praying for me. If you're taking the time to watch my channel, then that's the goal is for us to pray for each other, to help each other, to inspire each other to serve the Lord. So I'll, I'll pray that you're doing that. And uh, I wanted to kind of answer a few questions. And I really want to do an in-depth talk about it. And maybe I can get some feedback from you guys. And get some more information on the things you do actually want to know. But I get a lot, a lot of questions about... Um, what I do for a living, um, which, you know, what I do for a living is my own private business, but I do do a few things for a living, um, and I don't mind discussing those. Um, I also get a lot of questions like, are you rich? Are you a millionaire? You must be a millionaire. Um, how come you own multiple homes? How can I own multiple homes? Um. And then, you know, a lot of questions about stewardship and things like that. And the biggest, greatest, most accurate answer is, I'm not a millionaire. And I'm humble and I'm blessed. God is my provider. He provides everything I need. When I don't have, he provides. And when I don't have, I don't worry and I don't stress about it because I know that God will meet the need. My dad told me the other night, he said, you're the only person I know that don't worry about anything. You just worry about nothing. And uh, whenever there's something that I need to do or that needs to be done, I realize it. I, may, I take a mental note of it. And then once I take a mental note of it, I give it to God. And I'm done with it. I know that he'll make a way. I'll work towards that goal. And then if God intends for me to meet that goal, that goal will be met. Now that doesn't mean I sit around and don't do nothing to work towards that goal. Because I do. I work towards that goal. But I don't stress over it. I don't have fear and anxiety over it. <laughs> I just give it to God. And uh, biblical financial responsibility and stewardship starts with reading your Bible, developing a personal relationship with God, getting a job, paying your tithes, trusting God with all that you have, surrendering it to him and knowing that everything you have didn't just come from God, but it is God's. May you all be blessed.